name is Jaco Karras, and I'm a robotics engineer here at NASA JPL. And today we're here in the uh, robotic prototyping lab, where we essentially do a lot of rapid prototyping to come up with new technologies for future NASA missions. We've got things like 3D printers, we've got laser cutters, we've got a lot of good equipment set up. And so yeah, what we do is we come up with new concepts to enable new space exploration, and we quickly build prototypes, and we test those, and we try to mature the technology. One technology that's particularly exciting uh, that we've worked on a lot here is the Gecko adhesive gripper technology. The Gecko adhesive is inspired by geckos. But what geckos have on their toes is essentially a ton of very, very fine hairs. And so when a gecko brings its toe into contact with a surface, those fine hairs adhere to the surface with what are called van der Waals interactions. The Gecko adhesive, it's useful not only for grippers, but also for future space robotics. Putting this Gecko adhesive onto to wheels on a robot to enable the robot to drive along a uh, solar panel to do maybe inspection or repair on a satellite in orbit in zero gravity. One thing that we've actually uh, been working on a fair amount is microspines. Microspines are also inspired by nature. We're sort of emulating the claws that you see on the feet of insects or lizards. Microspines, they're basically sharp claws that we put onto the ends of compliant mechanisms to enable us to climb rough surfaces. Microspine technology is, is, is really, it's that if you have a surface that has a lot of holes and divots and such, and you have a lot of sharp claws, those tend to sort of opportunistically find places to perch and grasp onto. So now we have the gecko adhesives for smooth surfaces and we supplement with the microspines for rough surfaces. A lot of the same sorts of applications that we do with the gecko adhesives also apply here. We can build grippers with microspine claws for an astronaut wanting to anchor to the surface of an asteroid, or uh, maybe it's a robot that we put uh, microspines on so it can climb a cliff on Mars. All of these types of features are very challenging to maneuver on, and so we really need some new technologies to supplement future missions to get us onto those features.